Alright, so we're gonna start off with this Ally Double R scenario. Good afternoon today, you'll be operating this westbound service to Penn. Get started, set the cab up to prepare the train to move. Okay. Such a huge restriction getting out of here. Grab up a cut is a sensor best the keys are reverse the four rest control minimum break or max break. I didn't realize that this was interactive now too. Take care of this once we get where we need to get to. Or we can just acknowledge it. Okay. thing is I don't know what the panels here to cut in I mean it's on right now so I'm not really sure why it would want me to to cut it in. Yeah, the other train, the panel's here that lets you set that. Um, it looks like, I mean, it's, it's operating like it's already set here. So, I don't know. It's 
taking us a little bit of time to get out of here. So at some point there's going to be an issue, and I believe it's going to be a fire.
Okay, so... Oops. Good thing about these trains is the brakes are very good. Next stop is actually pretty close. This is interesting, I didn't realize that there was an East Rockaway until I ran this scenarios. Um, I'm familiar with Far Rockaway. Alright, use rock away. Next is Center Avenue.
Alright, so we are coming around the bend here. At some point there's going to be a fire involved in this scenario. So I think after Lynbrook we have St. Albans and Jamaica and then stuff gets crazy in this scenario. stopped. So yeah, if everybody's not sure, um, the screen is interactive now on this train. It's telling me I have a like an issue, but I can't um, address it because the controls to adjust the ACSES are no longer here. Um, but still working like it's supposed to. Alright, five miles to St. Albans, so hang tight. We've been restricted the whole time too. The line speed is like 60, but they've been holding us to about 40 this whole ride. There we go, now we get clear to 60. And we have 80 coming up after that. Yeah, I actually was at someone's house yesterday who lives close to one of these kind of uh, express sections of the train. And every time the train went by, it just shook their whole house. It's like, that can't be fun. Eighty, and then they penalized us with a penalty break down to forty. Okay, that was strange. <coughs> Excuse me. So we're going downhill here. So I'm just going to. Let it coast, and then we'll pull it back once it gets closer to 40, if it does get there. All right, we're not stopping here. Wow. All right, well, something's going on ahead, because they keep, like, really dinging us without any warning that these things are coming up. Mind you, we're still clear to 80. Now 
we have a few 30 sections coming up. It's like 30, 80, 30, 80. And then a 70. So is there a track change? Yep, there's a track change. A double track change. That's why those 30s were there. Somebody else is controlling the train because they're slowing it down automatically. I'm not doing anything. I literally just have it coasting. You can see it. It's still like it's slowing it down. Okay. So we just got to put on a new track. You can see it cleared it up to 80, but there we go. Okay. So we'll see how long this lasts, because I know 70 is supposed to be coming up after. I'll probably run this curve. Yep, so we're below for now. Yep, we know 70 is coming. come down to 60. So I'm just gonna get below right now before they penalize me. Alright, very good. There was the signage for the 60. coming up.
St. Albans here. Oh, I like these uh, light fixtures here. I like the old style lights. Side. This is St. Albans, Queens. Now these areas, a lot of times, there are a lot of famous um, musicians and athletes that used to live in this area. See here the conductor hitting the uh, buzzers as well. All right, so after we get to Jamaica, something's gonna happen here. Um, there's something involving a fire in this scenario, so we'll see what happens. I was trying to do one of the other scenarios the other day, and the game kept crashing. So I think that's gonna be something that they're gonna have to figure out. Thing here that showed that this was going to go down to 15. Which means something's going on ahead. If we have to crawl into Jamaica, this is going to be horrible. rail was broken too. If all shoes on one side of the unit are broken, no power will be available. That's strange. I actually like this trouble screen. It's different. We didn't have that before we could interact with it. This train has some issues. An incident is reported in ahead near the hillside facility, and all eastbound service in the area has been suspended while the situation is assessed. Proceed carefully and approach the incident site with caution. Okay. <sighs> it's going to be a very eventful day here. Alright, so we're slowly coming around. Okay, acknowledge a little bit of power here. So our speed's dropping a little too much. Caution's ahead. It looks like there's a red coming up as well. Let's we'll see how this all plays out for us. Well, 
also climbing this hill. Oh wow, look at the fire coming up. Let's take a look from outside. Ooh, that's not good. Alright, so they're gonna stop us right up here. Oh, I gotcha, I gotcha, yes, we're close to 15. Relax. Wow, it's a big fire right there. This actually happens a lot in <laughs> New York City. <laughs> Where trains will have to get like stopped because of a fire condition. Or like a building will collapse near the station or near the uh, tracks and they're unsure if, you know, the train moving by may cause things to collapse more, so they'll stop the trains. And this happens a lot. It appears you cannot progress further into Jamaica while the instance is still going. Contact dispatcher and find out what's going on. Yeah, I can see that there's a giant fire over here, guys. Pretty good effects there, too. Pretty good. Alright, let's call the dispatcher. Hello, we're currently reviewing the situation and putting safety measures in place. We have prepared all main line and St. Albans branch from entering Jamaica Station for now. You need to reverse back to St. Albans until we can reroute you. Okay, wow. Talk about inconvenience. Sorry, customers. There's a big fire and you have to go back to St. Albans. They'll be on the phone. Okay, so we're going to reverse into St. Albans. Alright, let's see how this goes. And we gotta watch the speed limits here. It's gonna be 15 back. I wish that they would just let you just change ends. That would make more sense, but... <sighs> yep, I know, I know. It's 15. All right, so big fire here, reversing back to St. Albans. Hopefully we don't, oh, we're gonna be going downhill, so we gotta match, monitor the braking as we head back that way. Yeah, cause it was a huge like uphill we just came on. So I'm just gonna add a little bit of braking.
sí. Alright, so I guess what they're going to have us do is just shuttle everybody well, who wants to go back, back. I wonder what, hmm, I wonder what I would do if I was actually stuck in this situation. I either probably would, like, see if I could take a taxi somewhere, or if there's a bus, but that uh, would probably take forever. If I could get to Jamaica Station, I probably have a few options, but maybe I'll take the bus to Jamaica Station, and then from there, transfer to the subway, something like that. The other thing that would suck is, like, I don't know if they'll refund you your ticket, because it wasn't their fault that this thing happened. So if you spend a lot of money on a ticket for this day, and then again, the service is really interrupted. I don't know if you get your money back. Here we have another construction yard. Looks like one of those uh, material warehouses. That thing is just floating right there. Very strange. little bit more power. Alright, just trying to keep everything maintained. Yeah, using a reverse, they don't want you to go more than about 15 miles per hour. I wonder how many businesses are actually still using these, um, these side tracks and easements for their supplies and stuff. Or if they're sending out things that they're manufacturing that way as well. A lot of trash gets transported on the trains and cardboard boxes and then like paper supplies alright so once we get to St. Albans we'll be moving forward there's about to be an ad break coming up so just hang tight
I'm just gonna go down here so I can see where they want us to stop. Uh, some of these used to have somebody who would like be radioing you and then say like, okay, you you know, count down how close you are to the end. But that is not the case today. So what they're probably going to want us to do is shut down this cab, switch ends, and then run a return service. Alright, door's open. Let's see if anybody's getting off. Nope. Open the doors, allow any passengers to disembark. We're here for the dispatcher to give you an update on your routing, okay? We are waiting. Hello again, under the circumstances we have rerouted all trains using the St. Albans branch to use the Atlantic branch to ensure the services can reach Jamaica and all other westbound spots. You'll be clear to depart of oh, you should be clear to depart, so proceed when ready. Oh, okay. So we're going forward, I guess. Are you gonna give me any instructions here? Alright, we'll see what happens. Okay, you need to change ends before getting to Limbrick shut down. Okay, so we're gonna go the other way. I'm gonna set this to emergency. I'm gonna turn off the lights here. Set this to marker lights. Key out. Key off. Stand up. You didn't want to get off? Why didn't you want to get off the train, folks? I'm gonna just head back. Okay. So the other train that we ran the other day had uh, the sliding doors um, in between the connected cars and then the bigger ones I'm out of it. Okay. It says Valley Stream. is charging. Let's see, what are we complaining about up here? Is it the same stuff? Oh yes, yeah, the same issues. Okay. Okay. Everything should be good to go. Well, let's continue. Alright, Lindbrook track one, uh, A2, my fault. Okay, from Lindbrook. Then we're going to switch ends again, and then go Valley Stream, Rosedale, Laurelton, Locust Manor, Jamaica, okay. Alright, so it looks like this is a little longer than they said it was going to be. Bye. 
five miles to Lindbrook. Seventies coming. Looks like we have a thirty coming up, so that's a track change. Hey man, how's it going? I was trying to catch um Cyan Stream, but by the time I got to it he was already like ending. Like I blinked and he was done. How you been? How's life out there in the Midwest? It's funny how we say all that stuff is the Midwest when some of it's the Mid East. But they act like they're far away from the East Coast. What's good, mine? So it's probably going to be a track change, which is why they're restricting us to about 30 here. We're okay. again.
from have you been playing apex i played two games the other day yesterday i got one second place and then the others we got like 19th i usually play about two games at a time all right when we get to lindbrook they're probably going to want us to change ends again and we'll head back into the direction of Queens. Which is back west. Oh really, you're playing Star Citizen. Well, that's interesting. Yeah, I never really started to play it. I feel I felt like it probably worked my computer out a little bit more than I was willing to um, have it stretched. But uh, I saw Cyan playing it when it first came out, and then Kojo62 used to play it for a little bit. Um, but yeah, then everybody kind of stopped playing it. Oh no, actually, I'm confusing two things. Um, Star Citizen um, Cyan used to play it and then Kojo was playing uh, Starfield that's the one uh, but no I haven't played Star Citizen I used to play a lot of Elite Dangerous on stream though I haven't done that in a while maybe I'll get back into it I got like one level of Elite status and the other ones were a little bit more difficult uh, one was Exploring and the other one is Combat so I haven't really touched those yet Alright, so they're slowing us down as we come into the station here. 15 is what they want. Once we get stopped, probably unload passengers. And we'll go from there. Oh no, they just want us to stop and switch ends. Really not Elite Dangerous? Wow. You know, I don't know where they found you. I thought you was a good person. Turns out you just like all the others. You a straight up buster. You a straight buster. Yo, did you take any trips yet? I know you've been talking about going places, but you haven't gone anywhere yet. We did um, Florida last week. Went to Disney for a few days. Alright, so we're going to just take a quick break here and we'll finish this up once we stop. Okay, you went to Chicago? I like Chicago. One of my friends is actually there now. It's the first time she's ever been to Chicago. We might go in the fall to visit some family. Because we haven't been in a few years. Here we go. This thing wants us to be precise again. All right, give me one second. We'll shut the train down. Let's turn the lights off. Uh, next, we're going to put the marker lights on. We already set it to key out. And turn off. Alright, change ends again. Perhaps some people who are still on the train. Because we did not open the doors to let anybody out this time. Alright, folks, we are heading back into city. We're going 
going to make our way to Jamaica. We'll just have a few stops in between. They should just set this one express to Jamaica, but I'm not in charge here. Forward lights off max break. It automatically charges, which is good. Before you used to have to press the button here on the older trains, but this one seems to be set to do it automatically. So now we set some power and we're off. How long were you in Chicago? Alright, so we're going to do three stops. We have Valley Stream, Rosedale, Laurelton. Oh, actually, more than three. Valley Stream, Rosedale. Come on. This thing is so annoying with that. Like we're going downhill. Stop it. Laurelton, Locust Manor, and then Jamaica. And then we're going to get an outro briefing. Like, you have us going downhill. 15 needs to be stretched to maybe 20 then. Alright, waiting for the back of this train to pass. Come on. There's another thing that I, I like, wish that they would fix. So, a lot of times when you're waiting for a speed increase, they're waiting for the back of the train to pass that point. But then when you're decreasing speed, the front of the train gets there and then you get penalized. So why don't you have the front of the train work as the marker in both directions? I don't know. I feel like I might be the only person who complains about that. So. Seventy. That's going to bring us down to 60 and then down to 30 as there's another track change. Yeah, whenever you see these like 30s popping up, that means that they're changing us on the tracks. do is keep it at about 50 for now. Oh, there we go. Wow, that was faster than I thought it was going to be. Now they're bringing us down to 40. Come on.
Okay, pick up passengers here. I do like these lights that they have though. They're actually pretty cool. Alright, this is... I forget which station we're at already. Valley Stream. Next is Rosedale. Waiting for them to buzz. <laughs> That's the all clear buzz from the conductor. Alright, Rosedale's next. Alright, so we probably have a curve coming up as they're bringing us down to 60. Good thing about this one is that they haven't given us any strict times because there's so much stuff happening. you missed it, there was a big fire that happened on the stream. I'm going to bring it to 55. And we'll hold. Beautiful. Because we do have a 60 coming up. Which means we're going to be probably making a turn to the left, most likely. Yep, I can see it coming. You get used to these things when you play this enough. Okay. If you're just joining us, unfortunately you missed a big problem in the scenario. There was a warehouse that was on fire. That was preventing us from accessing one of the stations the way that we were supposed to. So we have to backtrack now, and now we're heading to the station through another set of tracks. Hey Kojo, how's it going? Um, again, if you just came in, you missed the part where there was a big fire. Um, so, unfortunately, because of that fire, we had to reroute and use another set of tracks. How's it going, Kojo? It's good to see you. Oh, okay, you've done that one already. That's cool. Yeah, one of the scenarios hasn't been working. Every time I try to do it, I tried to do it on the Thursday stream, and it just kept crashing the PS4, so... Um, I just went and played Car Mechanic Sim instead that day. Door open. This is Rosedale. Let's take a look outside. next oh I actually did the scenario the other day where you have to be a conductor that one was pretty cool uh, it's not for the motion sick though Yeah, I think that one's like an hour. Um, the one that we were trying to do was 45 minutes. Um, but it just, every time we loaded it, it would just crash. 
So that means I probably won't be able to finish that one for like a year. Because they're pretty slow with when it comes to updating issues like that on the PlayStation. Okay, we have Locust Manor next. Then after Locust Manor, we have Jamaica. Looks like a school. A little parking lot here. These houses are really close. As mentioned earlier in the stream, I was at someone's house yesterday that lives right next to some of these tracks. And every time the train would go by, it's also one of the high speed sections. Every time the train went by, it sounded like the house, well, the house actually was shaking. Alrighty, so we are almost there. Yeah, it was like, when the whole black like, building would shake. They said that they bought that house in 2001, so they've been in the house for about 23 years. Um, but they're actually moving to Long Island. Uh, they bought another house. Yes, one of the, those sections where the train's typically going about 80 miles an hour. Yeah, we're already there. Oh, oh I'm gonna stop in time. Come on, you can do it. Nope, we're not. We're gonna miss it. Oh, maybe not. Uh, that's the one thing I like about these trains is that the braking is very, very good. Locust Manor. I, don't even, I can't even say I've ever been to Locust Manor. If you have 12 cars, you stop all the way out here. So half of the people in the train won't be able to get out from the cars that they're in. They probably announced that. I remember on some of the trains, they were like, if you're in these cars, you're not going to be able to get off. So please move now before we get there. All right, Jamaica Platform 2 is our final stop here. I still have a lot to go on construction sim at the moment. I'm just doing this very long excavating job. Um, but we'll kind of work that into rotation this week again. Because I want to at least complete the American map at some point. 
and then we'll play around with the European map. Yep, already below. Alright, so we're going to be coming into Jamaica Station. Actually, when you see like all the different lines, you know, in person with this uh, with the LIRR, you you realize like just how much of a massive project and operation the, the whole thing was. And unfortunately, the construction in some neighborhoods just like cuts right through the heart of the neighborhood. Um, but you'll still find like people's houses literally like right next to the train. Um, but no stations, just the actual infrastructure just runs right through their yard or through their backyard or through their neighborhood, down the street, all that good stuff. I'm going to just start coming down now because I see that we do have a 30 coming up, um, which is going to be a track change. There we go. I gotcha, I gotcha. This curve is supposed to be a 60. But because of where we are, they are not going to give us a break. So Kojo, uh, and if you're still there, uh, trauma. What are your plans for the rest of the day? I'm supposed to be meeting up with some friends around three o'clock for a kind of a late lunch. I haven't seen them in a few months. We usually get together like every three months or so. without you having to give us all that. I mentioned this earlier, uh, this screen now is operable, so it's a touch screen. It's pretty good. We were getting some messages earlier about um, some of the pads lost contact with the third rail. And that one of the safety systems needed to be updated. Okay, cool. Yeah, it's warm here for us, too. We did a walk this morning, and it was very, very hot and humid. Yeah, I know. I don't know if you have Peacock, um, but Peacock has a bunch of sporting events on today. Um, they sent me an email the other day about all the different things. I think there's an IMSA race on as well, one of those endurance races that they're doing. I might check some of that out in a little bit. Uh, NBA playoffs, if anybody's interested, don't start until Thursday the 6th. So there's not really much going on in that realm at the moment. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, I have to watch Oppenheimer because it's on Peacock. I think it's still on Peacock. with this platform I'm always tempted to open up both ends I think that's what you're supposed to do here so people just get out on both sides I 
Oh, we've seen this platform before on the other LIRR. I was looking at some game and they're given a free upgrade. Due to ongoing situation and growing number of delay services, the train has been cancelled and will terminate here to ease further congestion. For now, open the doors, let the passengers disembark the train before finishing your duties. Okay. Let's see if that, f if we can see if that fire is still going on. Well, I don't see it from here. Alright, that's it. Um, oh my goodness. I think we're going to get penalized a lot here. Yeah, we got 1,332.5 points for speeding. Uh, and we did not get a medal. <laughs> uh, it is what it is. This one was required a lot. Ooh, they penalize you if you leave the vehicle unsafely. Wow. I don't even know what that constitutes. Um, so, yeah. So, we're done with that one. Thanks for the GG's. Um... I think that's it going to be it for today. I like to just do one scenario for doing a scenario and calling it a day. I might pick up some of these packs. Um, right now, PlayStation is having a sale called the Days of Play sale. They usually do it right after all the kids get out of school or around the time kids get out of school. Um, yeah, I think it's not. And I barely was speeding. It was like close to a mile per hour over. Um, but it is what it is. Let me just see if I can see what the points were supposed to be for that one. Oh, okay. Well, they just didn't show it, but I still got the the platinum trophy. Okay. That's fine. Yeah, so um, what happened was this cutting down one, I tried to do it, and it just, every time I, it, it wouldn't load, it just kept crashing. So um, I'm going to put in a report about that one. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, I haven't, you know, I haven't read any of the forums since this game came out. Um, I don't know. I just don't feel like listening to people complain. <laughs> um, yeah, but everything's on sale. I mean, this is $10 off. Some of these trains are a little bit less here. We have all of these. Trying to see which ones we don't have. Oh, what issues did you have? Yeah, I usually just like, uh. Yeah, I haven't actually downloaded a bunch of these yet either. Edinburgh, Glasgow. Glossip. I do have a lot of Scottish lines, as I notice. I didn't get, I don't think I got the newest Scottish line. $60. Yeah, I didn't get the five circle line yet. City this fire. Alright, we just did two of those. Oh, I never did a timetable yet. Yeah, okay. <sighs> There's so many lines now. It's crazy. straightforward mm. 
was strange because we did this before. I guess we'd have to do it on a new version. Some of it doesn't look like it came over from the old one. Oh, you know what it is? I didn't download them yet. That's what happened. So I'm like, I know I did some of these already. I just have to download the pack in order for it to come over. Um, oh, I got all these already? That's interesting. Oh, it's only 50 miles. Okay. Yeah, because they know with these, this is the one with the train. Um, usually, I think you have to shift the gears. So that one, a lot of people probably play it, but not as long as they could. Alrighty. So on that note, we will wrap up things today. Let's see who's streaming. Uh, I guess we'll join. I guess we'll join Wolfman. Thanks, you two. Stay as cool as you can, given how warm it is where you are. Um, everybody else enjoy the rest of your day be back hopefully on Tuesday if everything goes well we're going to go and join Wolfman759 playing Euro Truck alright everyone thanks again and stay safe we will chat with you in the coming days hopefully Tuesday and Thursday this week we'll be streaming